Cameron Shaw. Here's another episode of Azo TV. It's about to be the Chris Marine from Sarah Sur Highway, and he's going to show us some of the products and some of the materials that they manufacture from some of their advanced strap materials. So, what have we got here in the display cabinet, Chris? Well, you have a, a set of uh, ceramic products, ruby and sapphire, all done for um, scientific instruments in particular for uh, fluid handling devices or for medical application such as insulators, blades, <laughs> uh, tubes um, and any uh, custom-made application where customers need uh, high precision ceramics. Okay. And these ones in particular here, these small red and, red, red and translucent materials? These are uh, ruby, sapphire and ceramic jewels. Uh, hole jewels. Uh, we do the drilling, the enlarging, turning and finishing of the parts. Uh, these are used as nozzles, um, uh, air restrictors, restrictors for hydraulics or bearings uh, for watches. And what sort of resolution, what size of sort of uh, size can you get down to with those? Uh, we do between uh, 0.1 millimeter to about uh, 6 to 7 millimeters in diameter, a whole diameter. Okay. And over here you've got some pistons and things for pumps? Eh? Yeah, for HPLC pumps, uh, metering pumps. So you can obviously manufacture the ceramic parts and then interface those with the required we, metallic components as well? We press fit the ceramic onto the metal. And what sort of, that, that's, there's zirconia ceramics, are there? Uh, mostly zirconia. You have also some uh, alumina pistons and the transparent ones are sapphire pistons. Okay. And you also do a, a whole load of things for the medical industry, like these ones here, for instance? Like uh, little blades, which you see here on the other side of the window. You will have, um, if you go here, you have um, examples of uh, insulators for rigid endoscopes. And what material are those ones manufactured? Those are made out of uh, zirconia. And you obviously manufacture uh, materials with different surface finishes? Like some oh, of those ones we can see are quite highly polished? Yes, this depends on uh, all on uh, the application. Sometimes you need a shiny surface. Sometimes you need just a lap surface. So that one there, for instance, that component there is a very highly polished sample? Yes, it is. It's for a pump application where really the surface finish is uh, the factor for um, the, the device to work well. And you obviously are able to manufacture spherical components as well, like these ones? Here. Well, we don't make the spherical components. Uh, we buy those and we, uh, we uh, adapt them to the seat. This is used in a, in a check valve or uh, bolent seats in uh, high pressure pumps. Okay. And what, what are these components here? These are um, cylinders and pistons for metering pumps. So you do a lot of stuff that, that can cater for harsh chemical environments? Yes, all, all of them are very, uh, very, resist very resistant to uh, very aggressive solvents. So obviously your, your materials can take all those, those, those corrosive environments? Absolutely. And they are also biocompatible. Okay, yeah, yeah. And what, what, what's this material here? Uh, these are black zirconia. And what sort of application do people use that for? Uh, jewelry and watches and you saw before also um, in the insulators and they need the black color for uh, light transmit light uh, reflection oh, so they, they, they use that for optic type applications where they for the insulators you have optical devices going through them and uh, the color of the material has a big influence on the on the function of the device all right, Chris, if anybody wants more information about the materials and components you manufacture, they can go to your website? Yes, www.seramare.ch All right, Chris, thanks very much for telling us about uh, some more of your materials and components. Thank you very much, Cameron.